Historically, Middle East uh, took this initiative to have this program called Global Women Conference and Awards. Hello everyone, my name is Engineer Mita Labrushi. Today I'm co-host uh, the amazing event that we do have today at Dubai Desert Thani. Uh, it's actually the event is about uh, talking about the global leadership woman. And actually it's really an honor for me to be co-hosted today. And I know on Saturday I'm also telling people like, you don't need to miss an opportunity even if it's weekend. And because we, need, we have a lot of inspired ladies who are speakers today. And for me, I really inspired uh, like, to be inspired by their speech and as me, as a youth leader, it's really helpful that we learn from their stories, from their experience and to share also what I really have uh, as a youth. Um, for me, uh, I'm a CTO Scrum Master at Emirates MBD, which I'm really honored to. Uh, I'd, I would like to announce something like before two days was my birthday, <laughs> so happy birthday to me. <laughs> at the same time, I would like to thank Dr. Musa and Berkeley for inviting me today for as a co-host. And one more thing that I would like to say is that I'm always telling people that I don't have alarm in my life. If you don't tell me to stop, I will never stop. So I always continue my journey with no stop barriers. So it's a challenge, uh, you need to take a risk, you need to be open for opportunity. Uh, it's usual that at any certain period of your journey, you will feel or you will face some people who really stop you from doing such kind of thing. They will tell you that don't do, don't even bother yourself because you are really maybe you're doing some kind of things that is uh, let's say pointless or uh, you are full-time job employee who get paid so it's pointless to do these kind of stuff but for me if you really believe in yourself don't care about what people are saying take negative people from your life and just surround yourself with joy and surround yourself with positive people and smile whenever you start smiling to, to people like i'm smiling to the camera right now whenever you start smiling to people you feel so energetic you feel like you want to continue your journey and like inspire people so i would like to thank again berkeley for inviting me today and looking forward for such kind of future events thank you so much Good morning, everyone. Thanks for coming. Welcome, Ahle, Assalamu Alaikum. We are uh, very happy that uh, today we are celebrating Emirati Women Day, which is a very special day for UAE, United Arab Emirates. Before I proceed with the program details. I want to thank you for coming here. And uh, I will introduce my co-host for today who is going to help me, assist me in the program. Her name is Metha Al-Balushi. And uh, the introduction is very long and it will take some time to wrap up, but I'll just mention some salient features. She is a banker by profession and uh, a very versatile in educational career, uh, working for Emerson VT and engineer and an hospitality specialist. Uh, she is an ambassador in Emirates Club, founder body of fourth club G1000, member in the Next Generation Global Moment, and she has won various awards from the prestigious organizations. So please welcome Methal Balushi on the stage, please. Such a lovely introduction from you, Musa. Good morning, everyone. I know it's just the morning and it's already, what the day is today? Saturday. 
and I'm so sorry to bring you here and it's your weekend. I know it's the time to chill with your family, but believe me, you will not miss this opportunity to be here today as we have an amazing, inspiring speakers that I would like to thank them to be here with us today. And as I said, tomorrow we do have a special day to celebrate. It's Emirati Women Day. And it's really amazing that I I've seen a lot of locals lady we do have here to celebrate this day and also and locals which are really here to support us with this amazing day. So as I always say that, I don't want to introduce myself. I, I don't want to introduce myself because everything is written over here. <laughs> so the only thing is that I'm a youth leadership that I really would like to inspire the youth. And I like to host events and see these smile faces in the morning, which is really energetic me. And the only thing that I would like to say today is let's rock it. It's Saturday, so let's spend our weekend here in this conference, in this small room, to celebrate Women's Day and to celebrate the speakers that we do have here today. I won't take that long because I don't have alarm in my life. If I will speak, you will never, I will never stop. <laughs> so the only thing is that I need someone from the back telling me, Meta, you need to stop, Meta. This is the time that you need to stop. You're taking others' time. So the only thing that I need to do is today is to invite on a stage, our first speaker, but let me see, what is she? Oh, sorry, before introducing speaker, I forget you, Musa, where are you? Don't kill me, don't kill me, Musa, don't kill me. Where are you? Oh, you are here. <laughs> let me introduce on our stage, Dr. Musa. He is a group CEO of Berkeley Middle East Holding, the founding director of Berkeley and MS, MS Voice of Global Women. He is the director of the Investor Club, Dean Berkeley School of Management Science. He is the Master in Business Administration, Cambridge Master in Public Administration from Chichester, UK, Master in Law, King's College London, and a Chartered Accountant. M Musa, you're doing a great job. Wow. <laughs> Can I have a round of applause for Dr. Musa Sheikh? <laughs> 